I'm not playing with my edges this summer. No ma'am, I played too much last summer. <laughs> gentlemen and everybody in between I'm back with somebody else's hair and guess what it is wine and wigs day clink 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 what y'all doing today <laughs> me and my forehead are back hello does it look like I'm back with somebody else's hair or does it look like it's mine tell the truth shame the devil would you actually think that this is a wig if you had seen me out in public Unless you see my real hair, cue the music. <laughs> if the answer is you couldn't even tell that's a wig, that was on purpose. Because look, it also give, look, look at this. Ain't no edges out, but I'm giving this realness. Y'all see that? No edges out, that's baby hairs. But look, just a little scalp realness. Y'all see the track, I know y'all see a track back there, but that's not, that's not what we're talking about. I'm talking about my scalp. <laughs> Before I go ahead and ramble on about this U-Part wig, let's go ahead and get into the business of things. First, what are y'all drinking? I'm drinking green tea. Usually I'd be drinking wine, but um, it is 2.44 in the afternoon on a Monday. There's a line. But y'all tell me what you're drinking down below. Why y'all down there? Can you just hit subscribe? And can you hit the post notification bell? Just so you can see every single time I post because I'm always coming to y'all with brand new videos, brand new wigs, brand new looks, vlogs, things like that. Sometimes YouTube get dry and you may want to watch me. <laughs> Without further ado, I know that y'all got things to do today. So let me quit holding y'all up on the line. Let's go ahead and talk about this wig. So I want to say thank you to Eunice Hair for providing this wig to me and sponsoring this video. This wig is a very simple, super affordable wigs and this is the body wave u part wig in 12 inches it was 12 inches y'all know i cut it y'all know how i do it is 150 percent density let's go ahead and pop the hood on this wig the cap construction of the wig it has three combs around the u part and three combs around the perimeter of the head so i have two combs right here and one in the back and i also have one two three in the back and an adjustable strap I gotta be honest with y'all, the combs on the side can't attach to nothing because I ain't really got hair like that right there. Of course, when I received this wig, it came in the beautiful red Eunice hair box. And inside of that box, you also get gifts. The gifts that I received was, what did I get? I got a wig cap, a headband, huge Eeyore lashes. They also sent me a Eunice Babe. I want to call it a Eunice Babe. A Eunice Babe robe. Now you can get that from the Eunice Hair website. I think it's super cute. So when I received the wig and I pulled her out of the box, she came in this body wave texture, very natural density, and a normal body wave texture. Your girl, just a regular U part body wave wig or a simple dimple. Y'all know for me, I just can't be pulling wigs out of the pack and throwing them on my head and calling it a day. I mean, I can, but would I have a channel? <laughs> When I pulled the wig out of the box, I had to figure out what I wanted to do with the wig and how I wanted to style her. But the most important thing with you part wigs for me is not a whole lot of leave out and making it look realistic and no edges out. I'm not playing with my edges this summer. No ma'am, I played too much last summer. <laughs> we did a no edges out, no edges out sort of Look, so only the only hair that is out is the hair up top. Ooh, y'all know my hair thin. If you got fine hair, you already know that covering tracks is a part-time job. <laughs> I use hot rollers to curl this hair. I did a little bit of styling, a little bit of cutting. If you want to see what I did to make this wig look like my hair, do the no edges look, all of that, please keep on watching. And I'll be back at the very end with a coupon code and my final thoughts. Good morning, y'all. Let's go ahead and get started. I don't know why I'm saying morning. It's probably not morning to y'all. So let's go ahead and get started with applying this wig. But first, let me show y'all what the Eunice hair gave me. Isn't this cute? I think you can pick this up from their website if you would like one. You can go ahead and pick up one. Let's go ahead and get started with our hair. Okay, disclaimer. My hair dirty. I ain't washed her in about two weeks. So, you know, it's giving dandruff. It's giving Eco Styler Gel. It's giving um, ski slope in the summer. Not summer. This is the unit right here. It has these anchors. Um, please don't be alarmed. You're not gonna see this on your scalp, girl. You're not gonna be walking around with bra straps on your scalp. Don't worry. 
So before we do all of this, let's go ahead and take the hair down. Y'all, I'm nervous. Oh, it's not that bad. Yes. We just gonna start like this. You know what I'm saying? Like we just gonna, that's a lot of leave out, huh? So I'm parting away the, oh girl, that back there is disturbing. Okay, so I'm just gonna part away some hair right here. This is how much leave out we're going to have. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and braid this hair away. Get it out of the way while we do our base. So when I'm doing my base for my wigs, first I figure out where my leave out is. Boom, just did it. For the actual base, I like to braid down my hair and create a secure corn road base can y'all take me seriously with that in my hip face hold on what i like to do is create an anchor braid and then braid downwards i don't have a whole lot of hair so i can do a braid right here and then braid it down and i'm good so it's gonna braid backwards so we braid like this these press-ons are really hating and then braid down and gather the rest of my hair as i go but i like to leave no edges out because it protects my edges i don't have to straighten them no edges out at all So the hair is braided down. I placed a little hair tie at the end of my ponytail because my hair is really short and it unravels and then next thing you know, the, the wig is a mess. So now that we've done the base, next we can go ahead and do our baby hairs. Now baby hairs aren't super important because the style that I'm thinking of, I don't think you're gonna see my edges anyway, but just in case they catch you on the beach and the wind is blowing, they ain't gonna be able to catch your teeth. I like to get my baby hairs hoard, crisp. So I like to take my RS olive oil grip gel to get really, really crispy baby hairs. When I have crispy baby hairs, they don't move under a U-part wig. So I just like to take a little baby hair brush and or toothbrush and just brush down those baby hairs. For me, I like to brush down as much as possible because I got a lot of broken off hairs in this area. So, ooh, ooh, it's giving finger wave. Let's see what I can brush down down here. Why are my eyes burning? For the edges, this side, I just try and brush down as much as possible. Okay, so the baby hairs are down. I think they're still a little wet. Be, they're a little bit wet but i'm gonna let those set and in the meantime let's finally try on our wig i'm gonna keep those little anchors on here these little strappy straps because you, don't worry you can cut them off you're not gonna have bra straps on your forehead don't worry about it so i'm just gonna take this off and we're gonna try it when Ooh. This is cool. That makes it easy to style. Okay. Let's go ahead and start styling the wig. What I want to give with this wig is like body bangs. I probably need to straighten this hair out. I need to straighten this hair out first because right now it's just this body wave texture. I think I can straighten out this wig by using this Revlon One Step Blow Dryer. Should I put heat protectant in it? Girl, I don't care. I'm just gonna blow dry it. That ain't do nothing. <laughs> I just made myself hot. That wasted my time. And it made me hot. I just need to go ahead and straighten it. And I knew I should have just brought my straightener out and just started straightening. We're going to use our flat iron. I'm going to go to my, my T3 smart iron. I love turning this on. She always want to act up in front of company. Girl, turn it on. Okay. I'm going to use my Tresemme heat protectant and just spray it into the hair while that heats up. Oops. 
and I'm just gonna go ahead y'all see what I'm talking about with no edges out look at it okay so I'm just gonna hit it with a flat iron and get some of them bumps out ah it's hot oh my god it's hot this is hotter than I thought it was gonna be what is this honey I'm gonna go through and straighten my hair then I'm going to cut the hair So we've straightened the hair it looks good it's giving like 1990 sort of hair cut so right now what we're gonna do is cut off the ends you see how the ends are a little bit messy I'm just gonna cut these ends y'all know how I cut my ends it's real um unprofessional so I'm just gonna cut off the ends using my Annie shears Oh, but look at that. <laughs> Yo, well. Now, y'all already know it's time to do cut. It's cut, cut bangs time. Y'all know how I cut my bangs, right? You take like a half triangle here. Take one on this side. Take a little tiny acute angle. And I'm going to twist it. Just going to twist the hairs together. And then I'm just going to cut it. And then I'm going to take, oh, that cut really well. I'm going to take these two pieces and then just kind of cut into it like that. What does this do? Girl, I don't know. I'm trying to make sure they're not blunt. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, wow. That actually looks good. What? What have I been doing? Now I want to do it again. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go with a smaller triangle. And I think I'm gonna do this like three times. Triangle, make sure my hair doesn't get caught up in there. Okay, so we're gonna do this again. Take these two pieces, comb it forward and twist it. Keep twisting, keep twisting. I'm gonna cut right there. And cut into it again. I feel like a stylist when I do that. Oh, it's perfect. I do want like my last pieces to be kind of short. Like these pieces, I want them to be short. Take another couple pieces, twist them together, and then cut it to them one more time. Right where the nose is. There we go. And I'm gonna cut into it. Oh, this is shorter than I thought. Oh. <laughs> Now as for this part of the hair, I think I want it, do I want it shorter? I'm just gonna cut it a little bit shorter before I just trimmed it a little bit. I wanna actually cut it. I think I'm gonna cut off like another inch. I am cutting off another inch. Period. It's not even, but it's even enough. 
Ooh, but y'all see how these layers are looking? Like it's giving mm -hmm, mm -hmm, cute. So now that that's done, we can go ahead and get into curling this hair. Let's use hot rollers. Ooh, funners, okay. So these are the hot rollers. These are Remington hot rollers. If you've seen my Amazon favorites video, then you would know that these are my girl. So these hot rollers, like I said, are from Remington. How these work is basically you plug them up and they start heating up. And right now they're heating up as we speak. And you see there are different sizes of rollers on here. And basically, girl, you just get to rolling. I'm gonna show y'all once it heats up. In, the, in between time, let me show y'all what it looks like in the bag. Let's see what I did. Yes. While that's heating up, we're just gonna go ahead and cut these pieces. And we're gonna be curling our real hair with it. Ooh. So I'm gonna take this off and we're gonna cut off these anchor pieces. Just snip them off because we don't need them no more. I mean, you can keep them on if you want to, if you want to look a fool out here. <laughs> okay, you see those anchor pieces are cut, so the wig is free to be applied. So I love the sliding combs because they feel like a lot gentler on your hair than the clipping combs. The clippings are a little, they're a little rough. Only thing about sliding combs is that they're not as secure. I guess you pick and choose. Period. Okay, so material girl. Okay, now let's go ahead and do our leave out. Now, I gotta be careful with this leave out because my hair is real brittle. She real weak and it's been encountering a lot more heat since I've been doing wigs like this. So I gotta be careful. I'm definitely gonna flat iron my hair. Okay, so I'm turning it down just a bit so we don't burn our hair. For my natural hair, I like to use a serum. Because I got black hair, I need serum. So I like to use Fantasia I, hair polisher, heat protectant. If you are a natural hair girl, you already know what it is. This serum really does protect my hair and I love it. But the only thing is like, it makes it look like your hair is burning because a serum is on the hair. Oh, girl, I put too much on there. I do that every time. Girl, that's not gonna be just as greasy. Let's do this side first. Okay, so I'm just gonna flat iron it one pass very quickly with my comb. I'm gonna use my carbon black ice comb and I'm just gonna straighten it one time for the one time. You got one pass. Girl, make it count. Oh my God. It literally smells like fried chicken in here. <laughs> it smells like french fries. Okay. Okay, girl. That didn't even really do much. What is this, honey? So this is what it's looking like, girl. It's giving greasy. It's like a week old silk press. <laughs> That's what it's giving. But we about to give it some bump, some lift. And I'm excited about doing it like this. So these hot rollers come with two types of hot rollers. There are the larger ones and the smaller ones. So these are the two sizes. They're not that different in size. So we have 20 hot rollers right here. That is more than enough for this length and this density of hair. If you have thicker hair than this, then maybe it's gonna take a little bit more. But for right now, girl, this will work. Not that track in the back. <laughs> For right now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna, curl, we're gonna start curling this hair backwards, away from the face. So I'm taking my hair and, and the wig, and we're just gonna curl like the bang area backwards. And I hope this doesn't burn my hair, but these hot rollers actually don't stay hot for too long. Section this hair oh, away. We're gonna curl away from the face. So let's go ahead and start with this part first. We're combining the wig and my natural hair and we're just gonna work in sections and see if we can like get like a cohesive curl but i guess it doesn't have to be straight right i don't know i don't care i'm just trying to make this cute that's uh so we're gonna take a i think i'm gonna do smaller right here in the front yes i'm gonna take the smaller roller and these are like velvet they're like a velvet so it's not like metal or anything Okay, so this is harder than I thought it was gonna be. I thought this was gonna be real cute and easy, but no ma'am. I love that they're velvet though, cause it makes it easier to roll. I said that, but then I'm still struggling. But y'all see what I'm saying. 
roll away from the face and clip her down. Black owl. How you like me now? Uh oh, not my forehead, girl. Y'all see it. Okay, let's do it again. I'm just figuring this is gonna work, but I just don't know. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, we playing. We playing in here like we usually do. And if it don't work, girl, I'm just gonna end up with a straight. Y'all know I'm chaotic and a mess. So I'm gonna take another hot roller. I'm gonna take a larger one from right here and then curl it. So we're gonna keep rolling our hair, but I want it to start up at the top so we can get those rolls together and now we're just gonna freestyle it and curl all sorts of ways girl i don't know <laughs> i'm gonna keep curling until it's done so i'm gonna alternate between small ones and large ones use them sparingly curled now I don't know how this is gonna turn out <laughs> also hope it doesn't damage my hair but I don't think it will anyway so we're just gonna go ahead and let those cool and I'll be back to unroll it it's 115 right now so I'll probably see y'all at like 120 125 okay so it's what time is it let's go ahead and take this hair down I'm kind of anxious to see whether or not the curls took because this hair is so like slippery but I'm gonna start at the back because I want the curls in the front to stay but it's giving it works hello so we're gonna take these out one by one and see see what type of cur girl none is that a curl okay so we're just gonna release all of these and I'll come back when we get to the top that's what I'm nervous about it's the top Okay, so now we're at the top. I'm nervous as hell because I got to see my hair. But I think it did, my hair curled. Okay, now let's see. But period, 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 per. My hair did well, oh my God. Okay, so all I got to do now is pull this up just a little bit. See little dandruff and whatnot, but this is looking like my hair get out of town. Okay, now now we're cooking with grease. Now we're cooking with grease. I ain't pull out enough hair. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. This looks cute. I don't think I like the curls as much, but it's giving my hair. It just looks like my hair. Y'all see that? Like it just looks like my natural hair. The girls are wearing their natural hair 
with their pieces now. Like some are doing, like some of us are like switching it up. The girls are wearing tape-ins and micro links, all this, all that stuff this summer. That's not gonna be me, okay? Because my hair can't take it. But I can do this. A little bit of leave out in between my wigs because we still gonna take care of our hair and hide it away from the sun. I want to show y'all the bag, but I know for a fact, baby, that this hair is not even. I know that for a God-given fact. This hair ain't even in the bag. Let me show y'all. What is it giving in the bag? Is it even? Hold on, let me grab this mirror. Okay, what's up? It is even. It's giving newscaster. <laughs> That's what it's giving, it's giving newscaster. Y'all tell me what you think about this U-part wig down below. This is like one of the most simplest, easiest little wigs you throw her on and go. Y'all tell me what you think about this unit down below. She's super affordable for the girls that are new to wigs. This is like a really, really good alternative. I wanna say thank you to Eunice Hair for providing this wig to me and sponsoring this video. If you're interested in this unit, I will leave a link for this wig down below. But guess what? I'm also gonna leave a coupon code. Y'all ready for the coupon code? Y'all seen this coupon code before. It's the same one. If you would like to purchase this wig and get 10% off, you can use the coupon code MYUNICE. That is MYUNICE for 10% off your wig purchase. Get your money off, girl. This is an affordable wig, but then you need to save a little bit of extra money because we're going on vacation this year. Hello? I feel like I could have styled this hair a little bit better, but it is what it is, girl. This is what we had. <laughs> I'm leaving perfection in 2021. I love you all so, so, so much. I'm grateful for you. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.